Let's do a quick breakdown of thoracic outlet syndrome, known as TOS. So thoracic outlet is this kind of area right behind the muscles in your neck that goes underneath your clavicle, first rib. What happens is we get compression of either the nerves they go through, there's a branch of the brachial plexus that goes through there, or we're getting the vasculature, which is gonna be arteries or veins, the subclavian artery or the subclavian vein. So we can have different postures or different tightness of the muscles that can actually compress that tissue. And when it does, we get symptoms. So some of those symptoms can be neurologic because they're affecting the nerves that go into the hands. They might make you numb or tingly. A lot of people will experience that on the lower part of their hand, kind of the fourth and fifth digit. Sometimes it can make your grip weaker too. We can also see that we can affect the arteries that come through where we can get cold, kind of poor circulation in the hands as well. And it's very obvious, especially when we like put our hands up, turn our hand out to the side, you might feel some of those symptoms coming in. The other thing we have to remember is above the thoracic outlet, we have the branches or the nerve roots that come out from our spinal cord through our neck. Sometimes we can have a radiculopathy in the neck. Sometimes we can have a thoracic outlet compression of the peripheral nerve, or we may have other compression sites throughout the limb. Either way, we're either compressing nerves, vasculature, or both.